Hello best friend and a welcome welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having the most incredible day. This is the first time that you're watching my channel. My name is Sebastian and I welcome you guys with open arms. I do pop culture videos every single day. So if you're looking for a new messy best friend, you have found me. So why don't you grab a snack and a drink, hit that subscribe button because girl, we gotta talk. But we gotta talk about Kylie Jenner pregnancy bullshit okay but b before we do i this has nothing to do with kylie jenner but i thought this was so interesting i was just on tiktok and i saw that uh celine dion you know she's back and i'm so happy you know and she's talking about her looks with vogue right and then she talks about the titanic so imagine best friend james cameron the director of titanic he didn't want any songs right so this writer guy presented, you know, my heart will go on to Celine Dion. And she's made aware that James Cameron does not want the song, right? So then, I love pop culture, bitch. I get excited about this. Sorry, girl. Um, then, I'm almost done. Then, you know, he's like, just, uh, you know, let's make it into a demo. And then we'll present it to him and see what happens. She didn't want to sing it. She said, you know, I don't want to, whatever. But she did anyways, girl. Can you imagine the song that we now all know by heart my heart will go on that was the demo she never re-recorded it she recorded it in one take then they presented that to james cameron and that's how they kept it the vocals the talent of Miss Celine dion okay Anyways, girl, just thought I'd share that pop culture tidbit with you guys. Um, listen, Kylie Jenner pregnancy rumors, you know, go crazy. And then she denies it. And they're not denied. She shut it down. So if you guys didn't know, Kris Jenner's sister unfortunately passed. And they met all together, I guess, for the funeral. And they all wore black, right? And then this picture, this is, this is, the, this is the thing that I do not like about uh, social media sometimes. The picture of them, you know, they're all grieving. You know, MJ, their, their, Chris Jenner's mom is there. She just lost a daughter. They lost their aunt. Chris lost her sister. And like, you know, it's a very sad occasion. And Kylie seems to be like in sweats, just, you know, very chill. And the only thing that people are taking from this is that she is allegedly pregnant. And they are questioning that pregnancy. And that's the thing that I, that I Sebastian, do not like, okay? I understand that people don't love the, the I was going to say the Spice Girls, the Kardashians. Which, by the way, girl, I did a Spice Girl video yesterday that took me an hour and a half, almost two hours to edit. And, you know, I understand it's not, you know, your guys' cup of tea. But if you guys wanted to show some support on that one, I'd be really appreciative of it, girl. Because I'm not the best editor, but I'm trying to give you substance, girl. Anyways, um, so that's the only thing that people can take instead of like, oh, you know, my condolences, like, the, you know she's pregnant. So a lot of people are convinced because when Kylie Jenner is pregnant and she's hiding, she goes into these like kind of oversized, you know, type of clothing and stuff. Honey, they just literally went to like, I think it's like this island. I think they went to Turk. I don't know where they went, bitch, but the Kardashian private island. And she was showing everything, girl. Okay. She was in a bikini. She was going around in that damn beach. She's not pregnant. Listen, I will tell you something though. Like, I do think that there is a very dark side of social media. And I think that if you are not mentally strong enough to take in, you know, some of the content that you are getting, I do think that you need to ease off TikTok and social media. And I'll tell you why. Because um, sometimes if I'm scrolling too much, I get major anxiety, right? Because I see all these people living like their best lives and stuff. And maybe in that moment, I am mentally not well and i'm having a moment of darkness and i just you know what you should never do compare your life with people and you feel bad about yourself you know and that's a very human thing to say and a human thing to admit if you see someone your age living their best life and this and that like for example my one of my best friends you know she's she's she says that you know she's going to be 30 and that you know some of her friends already have children this and that and and comparing her life and i'm like that's their journey this is your journey but, you know, I'm very good at giving advice to people. But to take my own advice, I don't do it, bitch. So I also do that. I'm like, oh, my God, like, look at this person. Look at that person. But you can't do that to yourself, you know. So people who are watching, uh, you know, these type of comments being made because she wore a sweatsuit and or like a sweatshirt and people say she looks bloated. Imagine seeing that and you're not very like, you know, um, 
you know, stable in that moment, like you're going to be like, well, damn, you know, I look five times bigger than Kylie and I'm not pregnant. You know, that's what I would think, you know, like I'm like, you know, 10 times bigger than Kylie, like who cares? So I just feel like, you know, social media, there's a very dark side of it. Um, but I, you know, I, I don't, I, I don't like that people are always putting this pressure on women to have to look a certain way or else the baby bump rumors are coming. You know what I mean? Like, I just find that to be such bullshit. Um, but best friend, what do you guys think about that? Let me know in the comments below. Changing the subject just a little bit while I got you here, boo-boo. Um, I am really entering a new era in YouTube where I am really trying to... Um, you know, talk about different types of pop culture. There's there's a lot of pop culture that I would love to talk about and a lot of like, you know, my own version of like, you know, more, you know, thought out, more edited videos. So that's something that you are interested in. Let me know because I get a mixed response from you guys. Like some of you guys want me to keep it just very simple, just like me talking and, you know, a couple pictures because you say that you enjoy my personality more. But if I, if I heavily edit, do you guys like that? Let me know. Let me know because I would be totally open to doing some heavily edit and then, you know, most like this. Because I, I thrive better when I get to be myself. Do you know what I mean? Like, that's, that's how I thrive better, um, girl. Listen, I also wanted to tell you guys, the support you guys are showing me is out of this world, best friend. And I am trying to figure something out so I can give back to you guys. If you guys didn't know... I um I did a, a Christmas um, giveaway, which was I initially I was gonna pick like five or six people uh, of you guys to give a call to, and of course I ended up picking like twenty people because I or like twenty something people because I you know I want to talk to all of you guys. So basically I did that. I spoke. I think I spoke to almost about no. I spoke to like almost 20 people. There was a couple of people that it just never worked out. I don't know why, but um, I, I got to speak to you guys, you know, like 30 minutes, 40 minutes each. Um, and we, we did a camera, we did it on Zoom. So it was sort of like a FaceTime call. And I kind of want to do that again. Um, so I'm trying to figure out a way that I could do that because I will tell you this best friend that the, the, the love and support that you guys give me, even in, in videos or even in moments that I'm not feeling great or mentally, you know, that I'm, I'm that, you know, like last week I was going through it mentally and, and I think it reflected on my videos at times. So just to see that response, I just really want to make sure you guys know how deeply thankful I am for you guys. So if that's something you're interested. Let me know in the comments below. I would actually really love to do that. So Anyways, this was sort of like a Kylie Jenner slash update video, but I just want to say I love you all so much. I'm so grateful and thankful for each and every one of you. I don't take any of you guys for granted. I hope you guys know that with all my heart and soul, you guys mean the world to me. And uh, just thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for everything. So let me know if you guys want me to uh, do the calls. Let me know what you guys think about Kylie Jenner. And let me know what you guys think about, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, the, the Celine Dion thing. If you guys want more like fun facts in the beginning or end of my videos, let me know. This was sort of like a what should I do next type of video, bitch. I love you all so much. I'm so grateful. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Mwah. Bye.